so this is option number one this is option number two we can choose which one we like right not just that you can also change uh, the themes light dark or color themes or you can also did you know ui designs remains one of the main reasons why great ideas never get built most developers either get stuck making their product look much nicer or spend hours together on Sigma when all they need is just a prototype. Welcome to day 173 of the 1000 days of no code challenge. No matter how complex your backend is, it doesn't matter to the users because all they see is the front end. And if that looks cluttered or boring, they will leave your platform in seconds. To help you with that, we have explored a tool that can generate professional looking mockups using AI. Meet Galileo, an AI powered tool that converts your prompt or rough sketches into professional looking mockups, both for mobile and desktop. So let's see how it all works. So to begin, head over to use Galileo.ai and that will open the explore tab automatically. Click on sign up. Use the Google method or the email ID and password method. Select your account and then click on continue. It'll ask us for some more detail like display, what rates, company bit seven, your roles, let's say business and marketing, click on continue. Okay, must be longer than four capital. Okay, with seven, click on continue. So we have uh, two plans. One is standard and one is pro, but for now we can skip, right? And um, as we can see, we have text to UI or image to UI. So text to UI is where you can actually give some prompt and it will generate the mockup based on whether you select it for mobile or web, right? So let me add a prompt here. And I'm mentioning uh, a modern mobile app UI for discovering AI tools with a clean search bar on top category chips like writing, image, coding, and video. Show tool cards with name, icon, short tagline, and a try now button. Add a trending section with horizontal scroll with a bottom now with home. Explore bookmarks and profile. Use a minimal white layout with colorful accent. Now, because I've asked it for mobile app, I'll also go with mobile design and click on generate. It'll take a few seconds and we will have our mockup ready. Okay, there you go. So we have writing image coding video with the search on the top. We have some uh, options here with try now. Okay, trending in AI tools is available. Then we have comb, explore, bookmarks and profile section. So this is option number one, this is option number two. We can choose which one we like, right? Not just that, you can also change uh, the themes, light, dark or color themes, or you can also use some custom uh, colors. You can uh, change the corner radius. So for example, if I change from, this is the one that they have used now. If I use this one, okay, and I click on apply theme, you can see the radius will get updated very soon. Yeah, there you see, it was more rounded edges. Now it has become sharper edges, right? Not just that. You can also click on Figma to copy the design as equivalent to Figma and paste it on Figma and then make any changes that you want. Also, if you click on code, it will give you a HTML code that can be used in your application. Isn't this a great starting point? Now, let's say I want to have my own sketches. I have it in my mind, but I want to design for that. Okay, so let's see how that works. And for that, I've got pen and paper. Let me adjust the camera so that it can capture what I'm drawing. Okay. So I hope this is good enough. Let me draw. So what I want is a mobile screen with uh, this as my menu. That is my home. This is a search icon. And uh, this is say chat. I don't know what AI will think about my drawing. I do not have a good drawing skill, but um, this could be profile section. Or this could be client and this could be a profile section. Okay. And this is a box name designation uh email bar form 
right so taps like this and invoices i'm not sure if this works but let's see so the drawing that i've done is this one okay i'm going to share this again sketch that i've done myself i want to upload that from here so let me show you the image that uh, i've got so this is the image that i've got okay pretty bad right this was meant to be a chat this is search this is home this is client section and this is profile image okay logo and all of that you can see how bad am i at drawing okay so i'll go here and give the description saying create a mobile app design with mobile menu the bottom of the screen options for chat search home lines and file section and display the lines in the top along with their invoices Kafka bottom okay so I've given some uh, description of what I meant to design I've selected mobile and uh, we can also choose the themes we can also ask how many variants are we looking for let's say three okay and as we can see all of this will be public if you want it to be private you have to be in the paid plan I'll click on generate I hope AI can understand what I meant with my drawing and let's wait for a few seconds okay there you go it has kind of understood there you go I think uh, this one is close to what I had designed I wanted invoices to be in the table but it thought it has images uh, but you can see that this one and this one we have name we have designation there is a profile image added and uh, the chat the search the home the client section with profile section right you see how it has got a rough sketch into a nice looking design now if i can get my bad sketches into this kind of design then if you are good with drawing your drawing can instantly be turned into professional UI. Of course, like we saw in the previous case, we have Figma, we have code, and you will also edit. That means if you're not satisfied with the design, okay, that image will come as an input, and then you can write your prompt, which will then enhance the image even further. As they say, first impression is the best impression. So if you want your product to stand out, then you might need a minimalistic but yet very nice looking UI so that the user feels that they want to use it more. Having a good impression on users is very crucial because no matter how powerful your backend is, what user sees at the first is your frontend. So leveraging tools like Galileo will get you your first mockup without having to know designing scripts or spending hours on Figma. So if you're a designer, developer, or just someone who wants to bring your ideas to life, then Galileo could be your first point. So do give it a try. And always remember, you do not get a second chance for your first impression. Thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next one.